everything we do or choose in life should be based on our strengths, weaknesses and priorities. These are different for everybody and that is why there is not just one single solution which works for everyone. It's different for everyone. So is MDS for you? Hey guys, welcome back to your channel Dr. Batisi and I'm your dentist Dr. Jasmine. I do get messages and questions or queries regarding they don't know, people don't know what to do after BDS. They just see one option. First year dental students are messaging me, ma'am, how should we prepare for MDS? First year, second year, before entering into BDS, they want to prepare for MDS. It's like saying a fifth class a, a student that they have to prepare for IIT. I think it's not fair because it's different for everybody. MDS means a specialization. Only few people get to do that and that is a good thing. If MDS seats are getting vacant or people are not choosing for it, I'm happy. I'm happy to see that people are thinking for themselves. I have personally seen just a BDS so successful and especially women. And you know, you always ask that um, dentists are millionaires. Can we earn millions in India? Of course you can. 10 lakhs equals to 1 million here in India. That means if you're earning, uh, if your turnover for a one year is going beyond uh, 10 lakhs or is getting beyond that, you are a millionaire. I have seen dental clinics where, you know, checks are cut and it totally depends on your skills and of course many, many things which we are usually not taught in a dental school. I can assure you, nobody of us ever knew which brand of dental chair is sitting right next to us or uh, the seat allotted to us, which dental company or brand it is. We don't know. So we surely need MDS people. BDS need MDS. And of course, we need to upgrade dentistry. We respect them. We have to learn from them. If I cannot do a case, I will definitely call uh, MDS and without any ego or without any, you know, um, that, okay, oh shit, I can't do it and I have to call an MDS. No, out of respect, out of patience, uh, care that if I can't do it, of course, I will call an MDS. Why not? But the question is, is MDS for me? So when I was in internship, I was, I actually bought the dental pulse books, the basic MDS books or the basic exam books um, in the second year itself. Uh, I don't remember, I guess it was 9th or 10th edition or maybe 8th edition. So I was like, okay, no, I will go for MDS. And initially I wanted, uh, I still uh, was very interested in the branches like Perio, OMDR and OP. So, um, and then oral surgery, of course, it's now like extractions. I really think it's fun. After I got my books till the reach I time internship, I wasn't interested in MDS. But when I was in the internship, in the initial first 15 days to one month, I prepared like I had such a beautiful, good notes. But when I gave the exam and it was only my first and the last attempt, and I got something 91 marks. I don't know. And it was the first time that the negative marking was introduced in MDS, I guess, neat. So I was like, no, I don't want to do it. And I did. And I did prepare for MDS because my neighboring or the or the people in my batch or everybody where I go was preparing for MDS. So I said, why not? Just give it a try. You know, you should not be so adamant on what you shouldn't do or what you should do. Just give it a try, why not? And that was my first and last attempt. Then I decided two things. I don't want to do MDS, number one, and I don't want to go and settle abroad. You know, the interviews I take on how to go abroad after BDS, I honestly don't like to uh, have them. Um, the such conversations but it's because you people it might be for you that you want to go abroad who am I to say so that is why I do them so that it's helpful to you my vision is upgrading dentistry especially in India but overall as well whoever passes BDS whoever is an Indian dentist first I want to upgrade dentistry to the next level also uh, so when I completed my internship 
I visited a clinic. It was my initial first few visits to the clinic. I was in the last few months of my internship to get completed. And I, when I entered that clinic, I was, uh, you know, he said that you are a dentist, you will be a dentist. But uh, he needed a receptionist kind of a person he was looking for. Um, but um, and then he said that if you want to do MDS, let me know. I won't mention the college or I don't remember the college name and I won't mention the state name as well guys I don't think it's right but I was offered at least this is three years back I was offered a MDS seat and it was like you just have to visit the college once or twice a year and uh, that's it you will get the degree you just have to clear the exams come and clear the exams that's it that was mds i was offered there and i was like oh no if if i want to do something i would like to do it 24 hours this inter i mean like this interviews or this podcast or this videos whatever i'm interacting with you this i can do 24 hours irrespective of if i'm getting a money out of it or not because i love it and it's i think my passion too so um that was the thing and of course after that when i see bds doing so successful i was like no it is not for me um so now guys when you should do mds when you have really a burning desire a keen interest in a specific field like okay i want to know more about dentistry and even after you clear the exam you never know which branch you get but you have a keen desire because when you have that burning desire no matter what it is you can learn it so how to prepare for mds you guys keep asking so that becomes quick because when you know that you want to do that when you have a focus clear vision it's the end you no matter how no matter what if you are going to clear that you're going to get that second you should be okay with investing three years of your precious life if you're okay with it it should be fun like 24 hours 7 you are enjoying it of course it's going to be hectic hard work everything will be there but you're enjoying it Number three, you know where you are heading. Like I know, okay, I'm doing MDS. What after that? Will I be cons doing consultations, private hospitals joining or research, clinic, opening my up, uh, setup or academics? What I'm going to do after MDS? Um, so that you have to see. And number four, you must be okay with being into one specialization. And because I have seen um, PG students also coming or PG graduates or who our MDS are coming um, to join junior residency as an honorary um, to do because when you do an MDS there is senior residency for you there is no junior residency but you can do that honorary so you join that because you want to learn root canals maybe if you're an orthodontist or uh, you want to learn extractions if you're an endodontist so that way I um, I really am happy to be a general dentist. I personally don't want to go into a special, like a single thing. But uh, yes, if given a choice, I was really interested in veneers or um, how the cosmetic smile and everything. If given a chance, I will definitely go ahead with that. But general dentistry is what I'm happy with because at the end, what I'm doing here, that is my passion. I got to know that from you guys only. So, yeah, and most importantly thing, guys, there is no non-clinical branches in dentistry. DCI hasn't mentioned such a word on their site or anywhere. So, why we keep saying clinical branches, non-clinical branches? It cannot happen. When, when a patient opens the mouth, first thing what we do is take case history, see the oral cavity, that comes under OMDR. When we take a biopsy, that comes under OP. So why we are getting too much into that? Why you should not do an MDS? When you say that patients prefer or wants to go to a dentist that has a second degree to their name, you know, MIDA and there are many uh, such abbreviations which are used by the dentist which are illegal and not ethical. Uh, I have a post on Instagram, please see to it and even if you just write BDS and if you have awesome skills or you know your work or you are true to your patient or the way you talk, guys, you will be a good dentist. You should have satisfaction with that because patients don't maybe a few see that your degrees, but um, as such, there is no such thing. Everyone is doing it. That is why you want to do it. It won't work for you. Maybe initial one year, but after that, what? 
everybody will go into different direction guys of course our friends clo uh, stay close to us but we all go in different directions you have to choose your direction and in that direction i'm quite sure you will definitely find people who sync with you relatives are asking what you want to do next or friends are asking or you feel ashamed in front of the seniors who have done mds you know i don't know but please don't listen to such people because it doesn't matter at the end i don't know how can we be so casual after the 2020 thing happened that you should be satisfied with what you are doing you should be interested what you are doing and of course you should be earning when these things get up mixed you definitely choose what's your thing so choose according to you guys if you want to spend that much if you can afford go ahead with that if you have interest go ahead with that but if you do not have that don't be pressurized with and you should be okay with uh, being a bds it's a beautiful thing being a bds you are a doctor you are practicing since your third year you will definitely go ahead with something at least in life so no matter in which college you have landed up how is it but from now on after this video what you do with your life is totally upon you people won't tell you what is the scope people won't share their things because uh, if they share there will be competition in that area why not so that is why you have to form or choose or make your own path and that is really the need of the dentistry in india for the dentistry in india and slowly and slowly and of course guys i have decided that i will be making the dentistry videos for the dental students and turns and the dentist in english but the videos such as um for the general public i will be making them in hindi and uh, guys on this valentines day there is a news i have to share i will make a video another video for that www.drbatisi.com is live section i really love that shop section because it has first year second year third year fourth year and under 500 rupees shopping under 1000 rupees shopping so this valentines day it was a really grateful and it was a uh, from the bottom of my heart a great thank you to you guys stay safe and healthy and see you in another video this is vatisi signing off bye bye